Moving on to other global news, China's Foreign Minister Wang Yi will visit Myanmar on Wednesday. Wang Yi's visit comes in the wake of heavy fighting near the Chinese border that saw rebel groups making a series of gains in the region. Wang's visit to Myanmar is the highest level Chinese visit since May last year. Beijing has stepped up efforts in Myanmar to mediate between the ruling junta and an alliance of groups with which it also maintains relations. Wang Yi's visit is very timely as it comes after a Chinese brokered ceasefire in Myanmar fell apart in the month of June. Ahead of Wang's visit, the Chinese foreign ministry gave a statement saying China strictly follows the principle of non-interference in other countries. Internal affairs supports Myanmar's effort to uphold stability. That's a statement by the Chinese foreign ministry. China's ties with Myanmar's military regime have improved in the past year. Beijing has never condemned the 2021 coup that brought the junta to power in Myanmar and remains a major arms supplier in the face of Western sanctions. But China's ties with the Myanmar groups that has invited increased scrutiny, which can create more problems for Wang Yi on his visit to Myanmar. As per AFP news agency, junta chief Min Hong Lang recently claimed that the groups were receiving weapons including drones and short-range missiles from foreign sources. In order to press Myanmar's military and the groups to abide by the truce, the People's Liberation Army held live fire exercises near the China-Myanmar border in April. But junta and the group's tensions, that continues to rise in Myanmar. After the collapse of the China brokered ceasefire, Beijing has remained tense as the fighting in northern Myanmar can spill over the border.